Hey guys, it's Lisette here. One of the most frequently asked questions on my channel is Lisette, what are you wearing on your lips? So I decided to make a video where I show you guys all of my favorite lipsticks and favorite lip colors, lip liners, where I can show you what they look like and what they look like on me. Just keep in mind that everybody's lip color is different and everyone's skin tone is different and just because something may look like this on me doesn't mean that it's gonna look like this on you. And don't even say that, Lisette, oh my gosh, all the colors look the same except like two because that's not true. All of the colors are different, all of them have different undertones, all of them have different finishes and that's what makes them unique. And yes, I'm wearing falsies because today I was feeling a little extra glamorous and I put some on. I think I may actually look 19 today. No? Pushing it? 15 year old with makeup, right? Okay, so with all of that being said, now let's get started. So this is my natural lip color. I have a lot of MAC lipsticks, but I also have other brands, so don't worry. Um, they're just like all laid out in front of me. So this one is a MAC lipstick. It's a luster and it is called Shy Shine. And this color is a light pink. It's basically your lip color, but better. It's very, very sheer. It also has like a glossy finish, but it's not sticky and it's very, very moisturizing. The next one is also by MAC. It is a luster again, and this one is called Hug Me. This is again a very, very sheer color, but it's a little bit more purpley compared to Shy Shine. Again, this is a color that's your lips, but better, just because it's so sheer, it's really moisturizing. It's basically like a moisturizing chapstick. So the next lip color is actually a lip liner. This one is by NYX. It is in the shade Nude. So this is what the lip liner looks like. It's very, very, very matte. Because of how matte it is, I like to take a little bit of Rosebud Salve and put the smallest amount of my finger and just blend it in a little bit. I think the color is pretty true to the, to the stick. And it's not too light and it's not too dark because sometimes, you know, like really light nudes can make me look like I've died. So it's just like the perfect middle color for my skin tone. So this one next is a MAC lipstick. Again, this one is called Viva Glam 2. It's a satin finish. I love this color. It's cool toned, but it's not too cool toned because if it's too cool toned on my skin tone, it doesn't look right. It kind of looks like I've been swimming in the ocean for too long and it looks like my lips are like turning like pale purple, pale blue. It's cool toned, but just enough. If it were any more, I would look like I've died, but I think this is really pretty and with my skin tone, I think it fits really well. It's a really nice cool tone nude. This color is Tender Heart by Clinique. This is actually the older packaging. Um, I know that they changed some of their lipsticks. It's because I took this from my mom. She has so many lipsticks that she never even uses. Like I just took this one. She's like, okay, whatever. So this is Tender Heart. I love this color. It's very sheer again. This is something that's very natural, something very wearable for everyday use and something that like, if someone were to glance at you, they probably wouldn't even know that you're wearing lipstick. Okay, moving on to my all-time favorite lipstick. This one is Velvet Teddy by MAC, and this is a matte finish. This is the color that I pick if I don't know what to grab. I don't know what to wear. I don't know what matches my eyeshadow. I grab Velvet Teddy, and it never lets me down. I love this. It is my favorite color from MAC. It is my favorite lip color ever. It's matte, but it's not so dry that your lips feel like they're flaking off and the color it's just like the perfect mauve nude for my skin next shade is from ColourPop. this is tootsie and this is actually very similar to velvet teddy except this one looks a little bit more purple i love that it looks a little bit more cool and it also has some like berry undertones and some purple undertones because i think that looks really good on my skin tone i think it actually looks really good with the makeup that i have on today i have some mauve actually in the crease and this mauve lip looks really good with that so this this is the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the shade Abu Dhabi. It looks a little glossy right now because I just applied it and it's still drying, but once it dries, it's dry. This can, can make your lips look more dry, so I like to, again, apply just a little bit of Rosebud Salp on top, just like on the middle and the center of my lips and just sort of press it in, just so I can really hydrate my lips without them looking too cracked. I love NYX's Soft Matte Lip Creams just because they smell like cupcakes, they smell delicious, and they also have really good color payoff. This next one is a MAC lipstick, again, this is the shade Faux. Faux is in faux fur and faux leather, not like 
you're my foe, I'm gonna fight you. <laughs> I love this color because it's pink, but it's also cool toned, and I've really been into like the cool tone colors, and it has some hints of purple in it, but it's not too light. The main thing with lip colors is finding shades that aren't too light. It basically makes me look like a zombie or that I'm sick, and I feel like this is the perfect balance between being cool toned, being pink, but also having like that violet undertone. So this one is called Twig, and it's from MAC, and it has a satin finish. It looks more pink, on the website because I buy my MAC lipsticks online and when I was looking at swatches it looked more pink but on me it reads more berry and I think that that's it's all good it's cute it has some purple undertones I love that and it just overall is a very flattering berry shade this is max liner and spice I love max liners almost as much as I love their lipsticks this is the perfect sort of muted down toned red just because I personally don't like super super bold red lipsticks like Mac Ruby Woo, I wouldn't typically wear that. Maybe if I was do, going to an event or something, but I typically wouldn't wear this for everyday use. But this one, it seems like it's muted down, it's a lot more toned down, and it's not so in your face. This is Whirl by MAC. It is a matte finish, and this was extremely popular within the past couple months because everybody and their mom wanted to get it because of Kylie. And I was also dragged into all of the hype, and I decided to just check it out and see what's going on on me um i thought it was gonna look a lot differently than it does it looks very dark i thought it would be more of like a pinky mauve i thought this color was going to be more pink toned but i guess on my skin tone it just looks a little bit more red and it looks kind of like a brick color this color is not extremely bright it's not extremely dark it's something that is noticeable that you're wearing lipstick it is something that i would wear like to school or something if i wanted to just be like a little bit extra cute that day and i just think overall it's a really pretty color this is the kat von d everlasting liquid lipstick in the shade lolita i put this one on last because this thing does not come off it literally will not leave your lips and you need so many makeup remover wipes to be able to get rid of it so i decided to do this one last this is one of those colors that will be different on every single person's skin tone and lip color because i've seen so many pictures of this and it looks like a mauve purplish pinkish like medium toned mauve shade instead on me it looks like a brick brown red still has a few purple undertones it's still really pretty i love it i love the staying power and i love that it's matte but it's not too over drying all right guys we've come to the end of this video i hope that you all enjoyed it please let me know in the comments what is your favorite lipstick it doesn't have to be one that i showed but let me know what your favorite lipstick color is and maybe i'll check it out of course if you like this video then please make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already i'll see you guys next time bye Oh